Hey guys, can you see me? I gotta make sure you guys can see me. I think it takes a second for this to click in. Man, we got some cool stuff to go over with you. I wanna make sure everybody can see the screen. I'm kind of adjusting it here. Wanna get it just right. Okay, hey Jessica. Hey, Benny, what's going on? Uh, can you guys type in there if you could hear me okay? I want to make sure this is working. I've, I've actually got a laptop set up on the stand here, and I've got it facing just right. Jessica, can you hear me? I see, I see here, H-E-R-E. -E, I'm not sure what that is. Uh, can you hear me? Uh, let's see. Can hear you. Cool, cool. Okay. Vinny's here. If Vinny's here, everything's okay. Once Vinny gets here, everything's cool. So this is going to be really cool today. Guys, what I did was I was looking at people trying to run ads, and my God, they lose so much money. And this is going to prevent you from losing money, which is really nice, right? We don't want to lose money. Matter of fact, this is actually, this is craziness. This is actually going to make you money. And I've drawn all this stuff out. Don't let this confuse you. Okay, it's got math and everything up here, but this is super, super easy. It's super simple. Once I walk you through it, you're going to be able to do the same thing. This is not complicated. I was the guy who a few years ago couldn't send an email. Okay, so don't let this stuff get you tripped up. This is really cool stuff. And this is how you're going to be able to four times the amount of money you're going to make one of your customers. Let me tell you why this is so important. Because so many times we, we battle and we fight to get new customers and we spend tons of money to get this brand new customer. And then once we have them, we don't do anything with them. We sell them like one product and then we go out there and try to find more customers and more customers and more customers. And really the smart thing to do is once you've got a customer is to sell more things to them. They are like 10 times more likely to buy from you than anybody else, okay? So keep in mind that if, if you have a customer, we want to maximize this, okay? We want to just looking for more and more customers. I'm sure, you always want to add to your customer base, but if you can make more of those customers, all the better. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start you off with one of our real funnels, okay? This is a real thing. This is what I run every single day. Uh, you'll see my ad on the internet, and these this is kind of like behind the scenes. Nobody knows any of this is going on, okay? So once you learn this, you can apply this. Now, it doesn't matter if you're selling dental services, if you're a painter, if you're selling stuff all AliExpress, it makes no difference. The principle is all the same. Now the products in here may change a little bit, but the principle is the same. Now we do the same funnel for my book as we do for samples of Survival K Food, which is one of my brands. So, you know, it, it works, okay? Now if, if you have any problems with this, what I want you to do is put in the comments, because I can actually now type in the comments right here. See, I can type. Cool. So you guys can actually see it. Um, and when I type something in there, if you want to like or comment on it, it would help. Because here's how this Facebook things work. The more interactive you guys are, uh, and it doesn't matter if you're seeing me live. I know not everybody can watch me live in the middle of the day because you have a freaking job. Uh, or late at night because you need to sleep. Um, but if, if you put more comments in there, and I comment back with you, what Facebook will do is they'll share this with a larger audience. And if they share it with a larger audience, more people get help. So actually, by typing stuff in there, you're gonna be helping more people. Um, and they'll appreciate it, and that's cool, right? Maybe you'll make a new friend. So let's start off with the beginning of my funnel here and show you how it works. So the beginning of this, and can everybody see me still? Okay, I know I'm kinda of walking out of screen here. Let me, let me turn this a bit. There we go, so everybody can see me, right? Cool. Can you see me? Uh, cool. All right, so this is the first page that people come to on this funnel right here, okay? Now, what this is, is this is the actual sales page. I'm gonna turn this a touch more. Okay, and then we can adjust it later. This is the actual sales page that people come to um, where they buy the book. Now, this particular book costs people $5.60. Not a big investment. Okay, not a big investment. And I'm not going to get rich off $5.60. I mean, that's not the principle right here. The principle is to gain a customer. Now, here's the downside to the ads that I run on this. And I've been running this for about a year now. 
well, I think it started in February, March of 2018. It's pretty close to a year I've been running this particular funnel. And this CAC, and what this is, is this is your customer acquisition cost. It's $17.94. Now, what that means, and I just checked that like 10 minutes ago. So for the lifetime of this ad, it cost me $17.94. Now, what is customer acquisition cost? Well, customer acquisition cost is the cost that I have to pay Facebook to get somebody to buy this book, okay? So if you notice, this $17.94 is bigger than $5.60. So that's not good, right? Because I'm spending almost $18 to get somebody to spend $5.60. And granted, this is a uh, ebook, so you know they get a PDF emailed to them. But the fact is, it cost me almost well three times as much to get the customer that I make from. So that's not good. So how do we correct that, and how do we make money? I'll show you what we do. The first thing we do is we have an order bump. Now, if you were to go to www.jrfisherbook.com, and don't do it now, I want you to stay right here. You can do that later on. You're, you're going to see this. You're going to see this live, okay? But when you got there, um, what it's going to do is when you get to the actual order form, you first have to put in your email and you got to put in your name. And it's going to take you to the order form. And then once you get to the actual order form, what it's going to do is it's going to say, hey, uh, in addition to the book, would you like to get the audio version of this book? Would you like to get that? Is that cool? All right. Um, and when they look at this here, I'll tell you, it's, it's insane, but about 70 or 80% of the people actually do take the audio version, which is insane, okay? But we're gonna say for the, for the purposes of this, that out of 100 people, and this is the 100 people right here, okay, that buy the book, we're gonna say that 50 of them take the audio book, okay? So out of 100, I'm gonna collect $560, and then I'm gonna get another 50 people at $10 for the audio book, and this varies what this audio book costs depending on the ad I'm running, but that's an additional $500, okay? So now what we've done is we've gotten uh, $560 and $500. Now, if you divided that out, we're still in the hole, okay? We're still not doing good, so that's not a good thing. But let's keep going because there's more to this. After they go through here, okay, and after they get the book and they get the audio, we offer them something else, and this something else is more training on how to you know, sell stuff online, make money online, um, stuff that works, stuff that we do, just like this funnel that I'm teaching you here right now. And let's say only 20 of the people out of this 50 take this upsell, which is continuity. We're going to call it continuity. What that means is that's money that people are going to pay you every single month. So this is a course that we have here. Now, and, and let me stop you there because you may say, well, I don't have a course. JR, and I don't have an audio, and I don't even have a book, okay? So I don't have any of these things. But it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what the product is because once you find this beginning product, which you could you could get my book right here, and it'll teach you how to do that, uh, jrfisherbook.com. So would, would somebody do me a favor and just kind of type in there, jrfisherbook.com, because I, I typing back and forth and me writing and all that is, is really difficult to do. So this you know, anybody or everybody in there, everybody right in there, um, jrfisherbook.com. This is www.jrfisherbook.com. So anyhow, once you've gotten your product, which you can figure it out from this right here, okay? Once you've gotten your product right here, you need some type of bump. Now, I like bumps that don't cost me anything, obviously. So if you're selling, um, you know, a piece of jewelry here, and I have a client that sells luck, I know it sounds crazy, but he has all kinds of jewelry, and it has to do with luck and four-leaf clovers and all this kind of stuff. Jessica, thank you for typing that in. Uh, and if anybody else wants to type it in, it helps because if you type in that jrfisherbook.com, people can just click on it, click, like that, click. Now, I've gone this far, okay? I've, I've showed you the book. I've showed you the audio. Please do me a favor because I, I don't want to go too fast. I don't want to go too slow. Just type in there if you understand it. Just say, I understand. I get it, something like that. That way I'll know that everybody's understanding what I'm doing here. So just put, I understand. Or if you don't understand, do me a favor in that comment section right there, right there, okay? That comment section, put in there what you don't understand so far, because I want you to understand every step of this. Because if you grasp this, if you get these steps, guys, you can make money, 
Okay, seriously, you can make money if you grasp these steps. So first step is going to be your product. The next is going to be this bump here. And for my for my buddy that's selling the luck jewelry and all the luck stuff, what he does is he has a lucky number report. So that's his bump right here. It's a lucky number report, and they can download that. Now it has another one that has you know four lucky steps you can take. It's all kinds of different lucky things because the jewelry is a four leaf clover type jewelry. Now I'm dealing with my book and my audio, so I just sell the book and the audio of the book. And um, like I say, guys, do me a favor, type in there if you understand this so far. Yes, I understand, Jessica. Vinny, do you understand? Is Vinny still with me there? I think he is. Uh, stick that in there too. That way we know all the way over, all the way over there where he is on the other side of the world, people are understanding things. So now I've got my book and I've got my audio. And between the two of them, I've taken in, you know, what is that, uh, $1,060, okay? Which is going to be less than 100 times this, because that would be $1,794. This, once again, the $1,794 is what it costs me to get somebody to buy the book, okay? So that's what it costs me to get somebody to buy the book. Now, let's go a little bit further here. Once they've gone from the book to the audio, they come to another page, and the next page is continuity, which I just mentioned to you, and that's where somebody pays you every single month. This is a course, and this particular course is $27 a month. Now, if you don't have a course, that's okay. You, you could actually plug in somebody else's course if you want to do that. Uh, what we do for our survival products um, is we have a sample can of meat here, and then this here is you know, a monthly uh, or a big case of meat or a you know, big, big item that costs a lot more money. Uh, so it could be a six-month supply, it could be a year's supply, this could be into the thousands of dollars right here. So, but in our example, what we're going to do is we're going to say it's $27 a month for this inexpensive course, uh, and 20 of the people took it, okay? And 20 of the people took it, which gave us $540, but keep in mind, this is continuity, so these people pay this every month. Now, our average continuity on this thing is doing really good. It's like eight months, you know, seven, eight months right now, but we're going to say it's only four months. So four months times your 540, it brings you 2160, okay? So now we need to look at the entire thing and what's going on here, okay? Because there's a lot of steps to this, but this is how you make money. And remember, I was losing money on the book. Even with the audio, I was losing money, but this is where it becomes profitable right here. Now, only 100 people took it here, 50 people here, only 20 people took it here. But let's add all this up, and let me turn this just a touch. How's that? Look at that, man. It's like I get my own cameraman here. Um, continuity is 2160 on this funnel. The audio is 500. The book is 560. So now I've got $3,220. Down here, if I multiply this out times by 100 customers, because that's what I started off with, I've spent $1,794. Okay? But I've taken in 3000 right? $220. Pretty slick, right? So spent $17.94, take in $32.20. Not bad, right? Now I will tell you, I've got audiences that are actually getting book buyers for $9.45, which is really cool. Okay, if you can do it for $9.45. I've got some that are $13.29. This $17.94 is since the beginning of time. And keep in mind, in the beginning of time, in other words, when you first start running these ads, it's going to cost you more than it's going to cost you later on. So my cost, my customer acquisition cost has gone way down. Matter of fact, almost half on some of my audiences now. So it's really crushing it now. It's really doing good now. And obviously, I'm not going to run an ad um, that's not making money. But I will in the beginning. Why would I do that in the beginning? Well, I would do that in the beginning because I want to get buyers. If I can get some buyers, I can then upload those buyers to Facebook and I can do a look-alike audience and I can get more buyers okay and then I can lower my cost but understand when you first start running these ads guys you're going to lose a little bit of money in the beginning and nobody wants to hear that everybody wants to hear well, I want to make money instantly and I you know I want all this to work out perfectly it's not like that it's not a perfect science um, and I start off this funnel here with like 1820 let me turn this thing with like 1820 audiences okay now I'm down to about six or eight right now but I don't mean I went from 18 to 20 to 6 or 8. I started at 18 to 20, 
and then I narrowed it down to two to three, and then I added another 10, and I narrowed it down to another one, and I added another 10, and I kept doing this over and over and over again until I got a good base audience that I can run this ad to. And this isn't the end of it. I mean, I, I have courses that people buy. I do coaching. I don't do a lot of coaching. That's very, very limited. But there's all kinds of ways that we can make money on down the road. But I wanted to walk you through this and show you, because if you think that you're going to, if you think, let me turn this once again, if you think that you're going to have a single product and you're going to run ads and you're going to make tons of money, the odds of that happening are not good, okay? Now, I can show you how to find products if you go to www, and we've got a lot of comments in there now, so if somebody would type in that again, the www.jrfisherbook.com, you can go get it for $5.60. And some people will say, well, I don't want to spend any money, I want to free. You will never do well in life. You won't. I'm sorry. If you can't invest anything, I mean anything, you know, like $5.60, you're not going to do well. I promise you, you won't do well. So, you know, make sure that, uh, I'm going to pin this one comment here, because uh, I think it's got the book on it. Okay, there it is. Um, make sure that you are investing a little bit, okay? And that investment's going to make you want to do more. Now, I, I hear people say, well, gosh, I just don't feel like doing that. I just don't feel like moving this thing right there. I just don't feel like doing that. Guys, here's the truth. If you only do what you feel like doing, you will fail. You'll fail in life. You'll fail at everything. You know, I was at the I was at the gym today, and guess what? When I got there, I didn't feel like going in. <laughs> I didn't. There were so many other things I could do. And then you start making all these excuses. Well, I could work on this, well, I've got this coaching call I gotta work on, well, I've got this client this afternoon, I can put some stuff together, I really ought to work on that. And your brain will talk you out of stuff. Your brain will talk you out of doing the stuff you're supposed to do. And the next thing I see is people who do do the stuff you're supposed to do, and then they quit. They just quit. You know, and you won't gain any momentum if you don't keep pushing forward and keep doing stuff. You know, I do these live videos, and I'll tell you, I don't always get a huge audience. I just don't. Sometimes I don't. You know, sometimes the timing's wrong. The subject's not what somebody wants. And, um, you know, you can call them failures, but they're not because I get more content out there, and I train more people. And I know that if I keep working and keep putting forth effort, I'm going to get results. And that's what you need to do, too. So, you know, if you've started in the past and you quit, don't, don't quit, don't do that. <laughs> you've got to keep going, you've got to. If you want to be successful at this, guys, you've got to, got to keep going, you've got to do what it takes, and you've got to do what you don't feel like doing. If you only do the easy things, your life will be tough, right? If you do the tough things, your life's going to be a whole, whole lot easier. So does everybody understand this? Type in there if you get this. Type in there what you think of this. Now, let me see your, your opinions in there, if you're listening. Uh, type in questions, too. Right there. Let's see a few people out there right now. So type any questions in there you want to type in there. Now, I'm going to try later on um, to make this into a video and get it on YouTube, because I have people on YouTube and all that that listen to this. But, guys, this is how you make money. This is exact. This is behind the scenes. This is pulling back the curtains. This is showing you what needs to be done. Don't quit. Okay, I'm talking to you right now. Okay, you know who I'm talking to. Don't quit. Don't quit. Quitting is never going to get you anywhere. It's going to get you frustration. It's going to get you angry. Okay. Um, good. A lot of good comments here. Matter of fact, let me try. To, I'm going to try to type. Okay, Jessica says she understands. Okay. I'm going to put in there, thanks so much, okay, so I'm trying to get, I'm trying to, I'm trying to, I'm trying to interact, that's what I'm trying to do, <laughs> I'm trying to interact here, all right, cool, cool, guys, thank you so much for listening, apply these techniques, if you have any questions, it doesn't matter if you're watching this after this video, in other words, if, if this is live right now, it's Thursday afternoon, I uh, started this at 2.45, it is now 3.04, so not long, uh, about a little 20 minute video, but if, if you're watching this after I did this live, still put your questions in there, still put your comments in there, because I come back and I read these things and I'll respond to you, and if you have a question and I can solve it, you can make money, yay, great, great idea, right, so put your comments in there, it doesn't matter when you're watching this, I really appreciate you guys showing up, and I'll probably see you tomorrow.
I'll talk to you later. You guys have a great day. Thank you very much for attending.